Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I am reviewing doo -doo 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 -doo, the Starjoy Gold Edition 120 coloured pencils. Artist quality premium soft light coat 120 unique colours. As everybody's aware, um, I ordered these back in November, which were, I think it was the 19th of November and because of all the um i've just noticed a dent in my tin um because of all the delays with the royal mail and everything um it got so far into december because there was supposed to be a christmas present for me uh from the other half um and there weren't nowhere near to be sat found it said there was supposed to have got here for the third of december um and I waited till 7th, but there was still no sign. And then I waited till 16th and I requested my money back. <laughs> and then on the 27th of December, ta-da, they arrived. So I had to get in touch with the company and send the money back so that I could keep them. Um, so, yeah, they finally arrived. And, oh, by gone. Can't tell I wait to show you these absolutely gorgeous pencils. So this is the inner lid of the the tin. So you get um for for some reason I don't know why I've not even looked into the the booklet to be honest. But oh, it's not a booklet. It's a swatch chart which I haven't used. I've just used my book my uh, my book. But yeah, you get a little chart. Well, I say little, it's a big chart. And it's all named and numbered. So you get R1 red, rose red pink. And then you get a dear friend and a thank you uh, bit. But you also get the chart on here. And for some reason, it, you've got, it says 1R, 2R, 3R. I'm guessing that's red, orange, um, I think. No? Um, but you get R O R R O. It's not. I do apologise for the glare, guys. Um, but you get O Y O O Y Y G Y Y G G, and it goes on so forth. Um, I've no idea why they have that, but you get all the diff all these are the different colours that you can get. I have to get Brian to try and get that dint out for me. Um, I've, I didn't even notice that. So yeah, um, that's the, the top of the tin. And then you, it comes in this form to protect the pencils. And then these are your pencils. I'll pop that one in the lid. It's a, a big, big set, so I need to make sure if I pop those at the side, bring those down, try and get them all on the video. I hope you can see them all. Um, so yeah, this is all the different colours from the Starjoy um gold coloured pencils i know a lot of people have said you can't get them in the uk um that is true but there is a company in the uk that get them from abroad and ship them over um as i say i think it was a big delay because of all the royal mail strikes but you can get them um and i'm proof because i'm in the uk so you can get them in the uk um I will pop link in description for you so you can if you want to get yourself these you can i got these for um let me just see because i need to sign into my amazon account it'll be on my wish list uh, my purchase list orders give me two seconds guys Uh, right. They are currently at £56.45. Uh, they are usually dispatched now within three to four days. 
Um, and then obviously you've got to give them time to to come through, you know, to get to you. Um, so yeah, let's have a look at the pencil in general. So I'm going to bring it a bit closer. So with these pencils, um, they are, it's, in fact, yeah, I think it's in, slightly engraved into the pencil itself. You've got a nice gold nib at the end where you've got the number near, uh, the number of it along with oh, along with the, the name as well of the colour. This one is Deep Ocean. I have already swatched these. <laughs> Like I said, I couldn't wait. Um, and with this, it's premium base wood softened board. Sharp, the sharp ease, uh, sharpen easily. Uh, safe, safety and environment, it says. Oil-based soft core on these ones. And it's got a beautiful round barrel. Comfortable shape with a matte finish. So it's all a matte finish on the on the cut on the uh pencil itself and they're really nice and soft what i found is when i've been coloring with these though is that my finger if your fingers are nice and soft they seem to slip so when you're putting pressure on um when you're coloring your fingers seem to slip a bit but i suppose i don't know if there's a way to stop that from happening or obviously you can put those um finger things on can't you them rubber things to stop that from happening so i suppose you could use those um it, it, yeah, it's a gold finish with large and bold font on, on this. So it makes it easier for reading, which is great. Deep Ocean Blue. Um, and I'm just looking now at the information for you. Um, it says the premium quality, the design and development of Star Joy Gold Edition has listened to the professional opinions of thousands of colorists and artists. This pencil... This coloured pencil is designed for artistic success. Um, it has a professional quality and versatility and can create a series of bold, vivid, subtle and exciting effects. If you, if you, It can help you find exclusive fun in your creation as to create work of art that you are proud of. Uh, these are 3.8mm leg core, easier to sharpen. Strong and reliable. Uh, lead core to guard against feature, uh, frustrating breakages, which is what we all uh, suffer from really badly with some pencils. The amount of breakages I've had with some pencils has been unreal. Uh, during general use and sharpening so that you can colour with confidence. Uh, they are made up of quality pigments and an oil binder for smooth blending and layering. Base wood and special glue craft tightly held lead core and slats. Um, so yeah, I think these are a really good set of pencils. The next on par with the Artesas, to be fair. Um, so let me just show you the, let me just get the swatch. So these are the colours from this set of pencils. So I think we're going from, yes, we're going from this side. And then from this side here, all the way up, and then to this side. So these are your, your ready paint. I mean, just got a bit of mi mixture, really. Um, even though they're in order, one to to twenty one is this set. So yeah, and then I love a nice range of different yellows. Then this is your your next lot of pencils. So you've got greens, different shades of greens, blues into your purples and then we've got purples here and don't worry about the, uh, I think it's just about all the, the quality of the, the paper is reason for and being like that and I think I was feeling a bit tired that day so it was just a quick swatch. Um, just so I knew what pencils were what, you know, what colour. And then um, you get, it's like, a, it's like all different, and I think these are like your pastel colours and your, your flesh tones colours along with these and your browns and your greys. 
I mixed up that pencil. For some reason, those two pencils weren't wrong order, but... And then you get your black, your blue, grey, and your green, grey. So a nice little... A nice little set for price. And they remind me so much of the Artezas. So you get your rainbow set, your pastel sets, and then your normal. You've got a bit of pastel here. I like this one, Sea Fog. It's, it's like a lilac, like a. It's what I call uh, lilac, but they've called this one lilac heather, and this one's called Sea Fog. So yeah, a nice, really nice set of pencils. And as I say, for uh, £56.45, and if you've got Amazon Prime, obviously, free delivery. Um, so I'm just going to pop this set back in here. Oh. Let's go on there then. Pencil adapted up. Oh. Pop that one back on there. So, just to show you, I'll get this swatch chart. Just to give you an idea of what they look like. So, rose red pink is this colour. Turn it round a little bit. So you get your rose red pink. So that's putting some pressure on. And don't worry, that's because of the uh, desk. Because my desk's all lumpy. Um, if I just do that. <laughs> ah. like that. I'll go back over it now. There we go. So that's your rose red pink and then we've got magenta rose. Then we've got Vanity Pink. And they're really, really nice. As I said, I just have an issue with my fingers slipping down down the down the pencil itself because I, I tend to be heavy handed. Um strawberry we've got. And then we have Tiger Lily. But yeah, I'd really compare these along the lines of Arteza. Uh, and then we've got Coral Salmon. And then chili. Georgia, Georgia peach. Even though it's like a red. In fact, it is red. So I wouldn't have called it peach. And then we've got peach orange. And creamsicle. I'm putting some pressure on here. And 
and then we've got tawny which is like a, a, a goldy colour like a goldy brown mango marigold I've noticed with this as well um, there's some marking on it so I'll probably have to sharpen it be careful if you do get a set um, that if you if you do colour with it um, it could cause you to have black smudging on uh, your paper I'll try and find an area where it, it isn't on there marigold For it, for prime example, I'll just show you here. So this is where the black bit is. It's not going to do it just to prove me wrong. Yeah, it's not going to do it. Uh, usually you'll have like black streaking in it. It started to do it a little bit on, I don't know if you can see it, like on the paper itself there. Then we've got apricot. I think it's the uh, Faber Castle Paulies as well that has some of the streaking in it as well, which is really annoying. Uh, then we've got cantaloupe. Do apologise for background noise. Um, and then we've got yellow ochre. I'm only going to the to go to the bottom. Just it's just to show you. And then we've got egg yolk. Which is nice and bright. Maize. Canary yellow, really nice and bright again. Cheap blonde, not quite white, <laughs> I'd have just called it cream. Uh, and then we go on to grasshopper. Easter grass. Lemon chartreuse. Laurie Green uh, Spring Leaf Really nice and green. I'm looking forward to spring and summer Apple green, winter green, alien green. I love this colour. And P. 
pale sage I think I should go along and do all the other ones um, I don't want to overdo it so if I can bring you a bit away I'll carry on 31 find it 31 this is oh I'm getting really bad back so this is blue melody I've noticed there's a, a crack in it I'm hoping that don't affect it, affect it later down the line Um, and then we have aquamarine and blue mint Galaxy Blue Pacific Blue man <laughs> blue whale tropical blue Baby blue. Blueberry blue. I know I said I weren't going to swatch them. <laughs> Then we've got deep ocean blue. Frozen. Nova purple Lilac Heather Sea Fog Violet Pl 
Bookworm. Wisteria. Boysenberry. Magenta. Mauve. Razzleberry. Garnet. Pink fuchsia. Ladybug Red Carrot orange, sunshine dawn, do apologise about the wobbly camera. Um, my phone's on a tripod thing stuck to my desk so when I'm scribbling me uh, swatching it's um, nudging camera so I do apologise uh, green blue these are just your standard colours Mid violet, two more pages, and then we're moving on to the, next, the third page, which is red wine. We have golden butterscotch. Jewel purple. Princess Purple and Hemlock. I don't know why they always in some instances have different colours in different parts of it. I suppose it'll do people with OCD 
up the wall um like you've got this color and this color in the set of purples which is not somewhere i would have put it but um then we've got blue cotton candy Sophia Pink and I've noticed they have um, pink cotton candy right down here which I'd have put pink with blue um, then we have Destiny Pink Himalayan pink Vintage Vermilion Locks, I've never heard of that before for a pink, but locks. Then we have candlelight. Then we have pickle. Jade. Avocado. Green Orca Midnight Brig Brigantine Morn early morning sky to get lost palette art in a sec and we have Cerulean or Cerulean I think it's Cerulean isn't it let me just get the last palette to move these just to this side um, and then we have Aegean Aegean Teal I think it's a a a Aegean Teal yeah number 81 I'd have called that like duck egg blue Outrage Palm flower Royal purple Grey violet
Midsummer Pink. Pink Cotton Candy. Makes me want to go to the seaside. Ryla Pink Baby Kisses Can't really see it And then Flesh It's a really good pencil, this flesh. Really nice flesh tone pencil. Um, and we're on to the last page. Uh, 190, so wait, I need to get this one out. So we're back up at the top with, with Peach. Light peach, Palomino, Coffee Cream. Coffee Cream, this one. Yellow Peach. that I need stuck sienna brown I do apologise it'll go blurry for a sec just while I'm swatching there we go sienna brown sienna brown light Beige Barbecue <laughs> Unusual colour Well, unusual colour that can be called barbecue anyway <laughs> Terracotta Nearly finished, guys. Burnt Sienna. Good Earth. Tree bark. Burnt ochre. Spearmint. And then we've got, just move it up a bit, Misty Morning, 
got three rolls left. Ginger root. Light clay rose for some reason. Light clay rose. Indigo. Sepia, 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 French grey, French grey too. Nearly at end. French grey three. French grey four. Warm grey one. Warm grey two. Warm grey three. And then we have black. Blue grey. And green grey. And there we have it. That's a whole swatch. Let's pop the pencils back in. Oh, wrong side first. Let's get the ones in. Let's pop the pencils back. that a sec so bring it up better than just scribbling on a piece of paper I suppose so yeah this is your swatch chart now for the star joy pencils so you get a good look of how bright and pretty they look and this paper is not actually white white it's an off-white so you get a gist of what you get a really nice combination of different colors for the price you really can't grumble get yourself a set and uh, you'll be definitely happy with these along with the artesas and any other pe uh, pencils that you get and if you're a big uh, pencil collector like me then you'll uh, you'll love you'll love this set as well so yeah um i hope you enjoyed watching me reviewing the uh, 120 star joy <laughs> gold edition pencils I will be looking forward to colouring with these in the future. Um, if you enjoyed this review, th 
thumbs it up um, click that notification bell so you get a notification every time I upload any new content if there's anything you want me to review or flip through just please drop me a comment I will get back to you as soon as I can fill in that you can go across to my about tab and contact me, contact me directly through email which is a lot quicker if you haven't already I wouldn't mind if you would subscribe to me I'd really appreciate the support as always take care and I will speak to you all soon bye